Hi everyone, this is Alex from Ecotech Marine's Customer Service Department. Today in this video I'm going to show you how to cut some RODI tubing to insert into your new Versa pump. Uh, this is our blue tubing, it's quarter inch size uh, hardwall RODI tubing and uh, you can get that directly from our website. Uh, so I'm going to show you two different methods to cut this. Now what's most important when cutting your RODI tubing is that you're getting a nice clean cut. That's going to ensure that it is uh, able to be properly inserted into your Versa and allow for a nice clean connection. If you were to make a more jagged cut or it was a little uneven, it could potentially cause some leaks. So this is definitely something that you're going to want to be careful when you're performing. Uh, now I have two tools in front of me. You can see here I've got a tubing cutter. This is really a great option when it comes to cutting RODI tubing. I'll basically set your tubing in there after you measured out the desired length and get a quick clean cut. Uh, that works really, really well. The other option is just a box cutter with a uh, fresh blade on there. That's going to also work really, really well for you. For our purposes, I'm just going to cut a small piece of tubing here, obviously. But if you were doing this at home, you definitely want to measure how much tubing is needing before uh, go ahead and making your cut. So I'm going to make my cut here. If I uh, just insert the tubing into the cutter, push straight down, give it some nice clean pressure, cuts it right off. Get a nice clean cut and this is really going to work well. Uh, so next step would be then to simply insert it into your push to connect fitting on the Versa itself. What you're going to want to do is make sure that you are inserting that as far as it'll allow you to. Uh, and that's going to give you a nice clean seal and allow for your uh, Versa to work perfectly. So that is one technique. Again, if you have the tubing cutter, if you do not, using a clean, fresh box cutter blade is going to be a really good option for you. So again, measure out the tubing that you would need to, uh, to go ahead and make your cut. Once you've done that, you just want to go straight down and that is going to give you a nice clean cut for your tubing. I'm gonna close my blade here. But again, you get a nice clean cut. It didn't deform the tubing hardly at all because again, I'm using a nice sharp blade. And finally, we can go ahead and insert that again. Once your tubing is cut, you are good to go and your Versa is ready to be used.